Hey guys, welcome back to another video of Tech Paper. Hopefully, you're having a great day. Deal here, your host. And now, let's jump on to the Snapdragon 8 Gen 2 Basic versus the Snapdragon 8 Gen 2's overclocked version, which is expected to be available in the Samsung's Galaxy S23, S23 Plus, and S23 Ultra. Some upcoming smartphones with the Snapdragon's 8 Gen 2 have already gone through the Geekbench 5, including the S23 series, for example. And when they did go through it, the benchmark supported the following frequencies for three clusters. 3.3 GHz Prime Code, there is a 2.8 GHz Performance Core, and then we have a 2.02 GHz Efficiency Cores. It is not just the Samsung's flagship though, there are plenty of upcoming smartphones that will feature the Snapdragon's 8 Gen 2 chipset, and we have seen the benchmarks of some others too, for example, the popular Vivo's X90 Pro and iQ11. But if we look closely, there is a major difference in the Prime Core's frequency. As we can see, there is a 3.19 GHz of frequency in these smartphones benchmarks and that's the value announced by Qualcomm 2. 3.1872 GHz was the exact figure given in their official announcement. So how come the Samsung's run at higher clocks? Qualcomm has occasionally released an AC version that runs at higher clock than the base chip. For example, the Snapdragon 855 has a model number SM8150 and then they released SM8150 AC which is the Snapdragon 855 Plus which, which boosted the prime core from 2.8 GHz to 2.96 GHz. Now if we compare that with the Snapdragon 8 Gen 2 that was released this week, that is coming with a model number SM8550AB. So we can expect that the chipset that is going to be available in the Samsung smartphone should have the model number SM8550AC. It is not yet clear whether this chip that is bound for the Galaxy S23 series will be dubbed the Snapdragon 8 Plus Gen 2 or something else. But it seems pretty clear that Qualcomm and TSMC has found enough headroom for a decent overclock of the chipset. A few days ago, Ice Universe, which is a popular leakster when it comes to the Samsung smartphones, said that European version will use an exclusive high-frequency version of the Snapdragon 8 Gen 2. However, the benchmarks we have seen so far comes from US models, so there's a probability that both models, the Samsung's US model and the European models, will have the exact same chipset. The leakster then further added more details about the prime code that will indeed be clocked at 3.36 GHz instead of the 3.2 GHz, which is the standard. But also, the GPU will run faster too at 719 MHz compared to the 680 MHz in the base variant. Official number from Qualcomm claims that the 8 Gen 2 CPU is 35% faster than 8 Gen 1 counterpart and the GPU is 25% faster. Given the overclock to both, this new version of the chip should be even faster than the Snapdragon's 8 Gen 2's base variant. It is hard to tell how much faster though for the time being but take this information with a pinch of salt and with that being said, I'll catch you guys in the next one. Till then, peace out and do not forget to subscribe to TechWave for more information related to the Samsung S23 series.